Welcome back to Moffin TV. I'm Ross Jennings, and this is Pete Kane, who's performing at 10:15 at Assembly. Assembly Rooms. Assembly Rooms. Assembly Rooms. We're just talking about just how confusing talking about it is because there's. And now I've got confused again. Yeah. <laughs> Assembly Rooms on Assembly George Street. Rooms. The, the proper one. And Pete, you're a regular at the Fringe. Uh, no, well, no, I haven't been for, for a few years now. Uh, 2005, 2006, I, 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 I did shows and, and this is the first time back since then, yeah. And what's it like being back? What's the reception been so far? Uh, well, it's amazing. I mean, I'm just chuffed to be here, to be honest. I, 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 you know, it's basically like Glastonbury with roads and, um, and the festival feeling's great and, uh, yeah, I think it's amazing, yeah. Really pleased to be here, yeah. And tell us about the theme and concept of your of show this year. Uh, the concept of the show is, uh, is that there are uh, too many people in, in the UK. Yeah. I think we can all agree that nothing works because of it. Everything's knackered, the transport system, the system, the business system, every system you can think of. Um, and the government don't even know how many are here, so I've got simple solutions to get everybody out and then count them back in one by one. By one. Uh, and then we only let nice people back in. Um, and then we build a beautiful utopian sort of society around the nice people and uh, talk about who can't come in, who can come in and, and um, basically you know, sort of solve the world's problems really in, in, in about 55 minutes. Well I've been running over to be honest because there's quite a lot to get in but yeah. Now, do you always go for topical issues, political, economic, Yes, yes. Like My last show was a lot darker. It was about overpopulation. There's too many people on the planet. Uh, we need to start killing people who should be killed. So, uh, but I've softened it now. This is much more accessible. That was a bit, that was <laughs> tougher for people to uh, to absorb. But yeah. Have you ever offended anyone to the point of them leaving? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I used to, I used to uh, feel like I'd failed if someone hadn't left. So, uh, so is that your aim in every every show? No, not cer certainly not now. Uh, no, uh, no, not, not really. <laughs> <Is it? laughs> See, even that's trying to leave. That's, uh, exactly. that's the effect I have on, on stuff. But it's good you've spent the money on it. So, um, yeah. So no, it's not. No, I just, uh, I just think that people, uh, you know. We're all getting hemmed in about uh, thought control, about what we're allowed to say and what we're allowed to do, and it's getting smaller and smaller and smaller, and, and comedy's job is to push back on that and say, no, hang on a minute, we need to talk about this, we need to talk about these issues. And, and push it back. Everyone to move, to move, to move. Well, yes, if you like, this is, I mean, for me, that's a, this is a large part of its job, is to, is to open, shed light on dark things. Yeah. Yeah. Now, is there any, anything you do not talk about? Uh, there's anything I won't talk about. Talk about yeah. no, there's nothing I won't talk about, no, no. Nothing, nothing, there's nothing too sensitive. Uh, no, not really. I'm not. Uh, no, no, there isn't. There's nothing I won't talk about that I, I think needs talking about. Yeah. I mean. Uh, yeah. No. And will you, is there some degree of interaction with the crowd? There's some a big shout. degree of interaction with the crowd because obviously we're letting people uh, are deciding who comes in and out, and then at the end I I go through the audience and uh, find out what they do a bit about them, and then tell them whether they're allowed back in or not. And then the big question is, am I allowed back in or not? Do you know what I mean? So, it's a bit like, um, I think it's Abraham who led people to the promised land, but he actually wasn't allowed in. So, uh, But they decide that a bit. So, yeah, it's really fun. It's really fun at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah, people, people really like that. And how have the shows gone so far? Really well, apart from the one when I went out really late and uh, my mouth and my mind weren't connected. <laughs> So that was tough, that one, yeah, yeah. Uh, but other than that, I'm really enjoying it. People have come in. Uh, I, oh, I basically sold out on Saturday night, which was a, which was really pleasant. Uh, although it's my least favourite gig, so so it just it's just uh, you know it's just everyone's different and uh, Edinburgh the crowds are tougher than you think, you know. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm sort of learning. I'm really learning, relearning. Really yeah, yeah. Fingers crossed for sell out shows for the rest of the rest of the rest of the No, I really like, I'm liking the 40s, around about the 40s and 50s. Half sell out is actually what you're preferring. So, so if you're thinking about coming, um, don't come really, um, so that I've got this right sort of number. <laughs> no, thank you very much. Th thanks a lot, Ross. Thanks very much. And we'll see you, see you soon. All right, cheers. Thank you. Ross Jennings from Waffle TV.